And today I have something truly unique and different than any keyboard that is currently out there on the market. I like to call it the Swiss army knife of keyboard. This is the Everest keyboard. It's kind of hard to call this thing a keyboard when it's more of a keyboard system. The amount of thought and detail that went into this board is staggering. You also get these crystal clear tackle buttons up here that mirror a stream deck. These are handy for general macros, program launching, basic system functions, and you can change the displays in here as well. They feel really good. Yeah, we're gonna have the numpad and then your media dial over here. This is where this board is gonna get really juicy. You can actually put this on the left or the right side. The additional keys for those spreadsheets and those four LCD screens can be programmed to do whatever you want. You can switch up the icon as well to whatever you want inside the software, make these things launch games, programs, websites, anything. And if for some reason you don't want it attached to the board, they also provide this jumper cable so you have some flexibility in position. It simply connects the numpad to the keyboard. Next up is the media dock. This is like a little pill-shaped add-on that offers dedicated media controls, indicator LEDs, and a round display module with a notched tactile plastic wheel. The screen, it only displays information and has rotation in either direction. It's not a button. With it, you can select the clock, either date and time, timer, or the stopwatch. You can cycle between the five profiles that can be saved from the keyboard. Then we have the lighting effects, volume adjustment that is instant and brightness of the illumination of the keyboard. I really like the PC info tab that shows the usage of your CPU, GPU, hard drives, your networks, and etc. Lastly, we have the actions per minute toggle if you're into that and a custom mode into which you can assign what the rotation of the dial does in the macro set. We have cherry red switches in this unit that can be swapped out to your liking. And just having that hot swap capability on a keyboard like this with as many features as it already has is just huge. You have all sorts of adjustable feet right there. As you see, they magnetize on and they are on there very, very tight. And again, you have multiple levels to pick from. This guy does not budge on you even with those magnetized feet. In terms of the driver software, everything is intuitive. In terms of the lighting customization, your macros, your key bindings, the display dial settings too. As a tech reviewer, this is the stuff we like seeing. I know I'm loving it. I have a lot of feeling. You guys are gonna too. The amount of thought and detail that went into this board is staggering.